If you use E15 gasoline in your car, I don't know whether I put it in my car. Maybe I do. I don't know. Listen up. The AAA warning regulators to stop sales of the fuel because it could damage your vehicle. And that's not all. CNBC's Phil LeBeau behind the wheel for us in Chicago. What's going on, Phil? Tyler, I doubt that you're using E15 right now. Most of the gas stations using this are primarily here in the Midwest, a lot in Missouri where ethanol is very large. But we're talking about a 15% blend of ethanol in gasoline. And the AAA is out saying, listen, the EPA and gas stations should stop selling this new ethanol blend of fuel, according to the AAA. E15 blended gas could damage engines over the long period of time, and that damage would not be covered under warranties. Well, Exactly what are we talking about? E15 is only approved for about 12 million vehicles. There's another 228 million on the road, most built before uh, 2010, not the flex fuel variety. They're not covered, and many warranties will not be covered if there's E15-related claims. Now, the EPA has improved the use of E15 ethanol blend gas since June. Again, we're not seeing widespread use of it. By the way, EPA and the Renewable Fuels Association, they say that, listen, over the long period of time, E15 is safe for vehicles. You take a look at the price of gasoline as it has come down over the last couple of months. The bottom line is this, guys. We heard a lot of complaints about E10, ethanol blended gasoline, a while ago. And those claims, you know, a lot of people are saying they didn't, weren't borne out. Now we're hearing the same complaints and concerns about E15. So I'm curious, Phil, are there blended gasolines that contain ethanol that are not E15 that I might be putting in my car, yeah, whether E10. I know it or not? E E10. Ethanol 10, which is 10% ethanol, which is widespread. And what I'm talking about, Tyler, is when that was first introduced, you heard a lot of people saying, don't do it. It's bad for the engine. Over time, the claims that have been brought forward about a potential engine damage, you know, a lot of people are saying they're just not there. And they're saying that's what's going to happen with E15. Got it. Thanks very much, Phil. Okay. Soup?